New at 11, a local veteran is biking his message of awareness all the way to the state of Ohio. Delbert Grush is on a 22 day mission to reduce the high number of veteran and first responder suicides in the U.S. During a time when many people, including veterans, are isolated, he says this is the perfect time to spread awareness. ABC 27's Christian Thomas shows us how he's planning on saving lives one warrior at a time. Signifies a stigmatic number of veteran suicides and the increase in number of first responder suicides. 22 days biking across the East Coast. The journey shining light on the post traumatic stress vets and first responders deal with daily. Delbert Grush served in the Army for years and his life spiraled after being medically discharged. Then he found Save a Warrior and got a chance. To tap into some unmourned grief and get to the root problems of PTS for me. That opportunity saved his life and with 22 veterans dying by suicide daily, he had an idea. In April, Grush purchased his bike, Liberty, and began training despite his muscular dystrophy. Since I have the ability, I'm just trying to use it to pay it back so that other veterans and first responders are afforded the same opportunity. The community getting behind him, raising over 5000 of the $10,000 goal already. That money will go towards three vets or first responders to enroll in the Save a Warrior program. Who has been helping over you know, hundreds of people right now um, to get their lives back. The Ohio Destiny nation, home of the Save Our Warriors headquarters. Grush says he doesn't expect the road will be easy, but no warrior's journey is. He wants to help all those struggling with PTSD to overcome. People deserve to know that it exists. It changes lives. It saves lives. And to me, it's about the journey, not the destination. Tallahassee, Christian Thomas, ABC 27. Now, Grush and his team leave at 8 o'clock Wednesday morning. To learn more about his journey and follow along, you can find this story at our website.